Howdy y'all, Fuzzy Biker here at Baxter Cycle today and look what I have found. This is a customer's motorcycle. It is a Royal Enfield Classic 350 Signals model. And I don't know what this color is called. It's a greenish, kind of an OD greenish color. He's got these uh, bags on it and uh, well anyway. So uh, these are a 348 cc engine, single engine I think. Overhead cam, two valves, one intake, one exhaust. Uh, five speed transmission. I just spent a couple days on one of these and uh, just absolutely ball, just an absolute ball to ride. It'll do everything but go fast. The transmissions are just smooth, smooth, smooth. One of the smoothest out there. Um, anyway, just check that thing out. Absolutely gorgeous. Everything's metal on this bike. Metal, metal, you know, metal. This is a cast piece right here. I just did a video on the uh, chrome bronze model. And I've got a couple more coming out on that, but this is the uh, Signals model. Isn't that just a beautiful thing? They've got uh, 41 millimeter forks, 5.1 inches of travel on the uh, suspension up here, and I think that's 125 millimeters, 300 millimeter disc with a dual pop bribery. The rear is a 270 millimeter disc with a single pot, and there again, 5.1 inches of uh, travel. Like I said, I think that's 125 millimeters. I'll check that. Ground clearance on these is 6.7 inches. Let's get over here and take a look, which is 170 millimeters. Check that out, isn't that nice? And uh, I wonder if that's a stock tire or, yeah, it's a Seat on it. It's a very beefy back tire. He's got about 300 miles on it. He's put these uh, Royal Enfield bags on it. And the model that I had test drove, they let me a, they let me one for a couple days. It had these same bags, and I actually really did enjoy them. They work very well. Um, they're kind of tricky to get in out of at first, but once you learn the trick, they're very easy. Uh, other things he's done to this bike, he's added this pipe, and that's called a mini Punjab Mini or something like that. Really neat thing. By the way, all these accessories you can get here at Baxter Cycle, BaxterCycle.com. They got all this stuff in stock. And then the other thing he did to this that I I want to make sure I show you all. This is a, I think it's a DNA air filter with a special opening on it. And he said it did help, it did help performance. Isn't that easy? Look at that, just in and out of there. Just, just a snap, you know. Um, beautiful dash, isn't that neat? You know, while I got, while we're talking about the pipe here, let's turn this thing on and see what happens. He's got a tuner coming for this too, or one of those uh, electric box things, you know, that uh, he was telling me what it does. I don't understand that stuff. So <laughs> I'll find out more about it and uh, maybe we'll talk about that in another video. Uh, the other thing he's got coming for this, which I thought was interesting, is a nav system. Now I've never heard of one yet that's had one put in and uh, he's got one ordered and it's coming in. So he also has a uh, heel shifter coming for it, which is one thing that I the bike that I rode the other day, that's one thing I thought would be really nice was a heel shifter because it really lends itself good to that bike. Anyway, just a absolutely gorgeous thing. And like I said, it'll it'll do it'll do anything but go fast. <laughs> and the ride, the way it rides, it's got a very thumpy, not vibration, but a vibey feel, very comfortable, easy, very relaxing. Kind of like getting a massage going down the road, just a very slight feel to it. Um, <clears throat> anyway. Truly beautiful motorcycle, in my opinion. Uh, coming up here, you know, I talked about this on the other video. It's got these Amal looking grips. It's got the rotary switch, you know, like the original bikes with that red color. Beautiful dash. And this is something that where they've spent a lot of time making it like the old bullets. The first bullets were, I think they were 1932. And uh, they had something like this on it. And uh, this is one cast piece of aluminum. This whole front end is. I mean, look at that. It's just, they didn't have to do that. They could have did this in plastic. They could have uh, made it in sections so it was easier to install. Look at those tiger eyes. Isn't that neat? But they, uh, instead they, one cast, you know, this is all metal. Absolutely impressive. I love this bike. I just love this bike. I can't say enough about it. <laughs> all right, my friends. Besides your rat, get on ride. Wahoo.